For the last 30 days I tested instantly AI reply agents, both the human in the loop and the fully automated one and I must say I'm pretty satisfied. I'm gonna share with you everything, uh, how did I do the setup, we're gonna take a look at some responses and how can you do it for yourself as well. So let's get started. Here we are in my instantly account. So this is the campaign where I tested it like month to date i think it's even running like for a month or something so we send like 8k p 8k emails it's still like not with all the follow-ups and everything and we generated like 27 opportunities positive replies and it was like done primarily with uh, the ai agent so obviously it's a four four step sequence like First email, second email, third email, fourth email, targeting B2B SaaS companies, offering um, AI powered cold outbound in the US. And uh, here are some examples like how it looks like. So when you go into the Unibox, you will see like these AI buttons, right? And then when you come here and click here, let's say, so this is one AI generated so we have been sending like all the follow-ups all the follow-ups and then he answered Faris thanks for persistence I have too much on my plate right now I'm not this over and reach out to you in a couple of weeks so this pretty nice positive response they're still interested and this was AI generated appreciate the update Alan totally understand having a full plate in case it's helpful while you're mulling it over here's a quick video that explains how it works and then this is like a loom of me explaining everything like evergreen not like super personalized or something and then i'll make a note to circle back in a couple of weeks to see if the timing is better then so in here i would definitely like set a reminder so let's say in like two weeks but even the ai should be following up with it Okay, so if no reply, this, this here. So when you go to AI agents, in here you have like, you can add these new. So this was something that I was testing with human in the loop and the autopilot one. So the main difference, let's say when you click here, add new one, let's call this one test one three is, uh, so yeah, right now you can select only this one, AI sales agent coming. That's something that they're working on. And then we have the human in the loop and the fully automated. So human in the loop is basically, they just like, uh, it prepares everything, but still you need to click reply. So first I have been using this and it works kind of the same, but it doesn't send anything like automatically. You need to approve it and click. And when I saw it's like usually generating what I wanted, I was just like, let's go with the autopilot one. And it's working pretty fine. So when you click here, you have these options like agent should handle follow ups, agent should respond to automatic emails, handle objections. So I don't think you need to respond to automatic emails. These two you can say let as, as it is. And then you can select the campaigns here. Let's say you select one of these or tags or something, click continue. And then in here you can like choose agent's tone of voice, agent's response lag. So I left this just by standard, like professional standard. I didn't like test stuff here. And in here, this will be like um, empty for you. So you can enable or disable these ones. And what I did, I like um, put into ChatGPT all my responses, everything from the past, my campaign, my ICP, and I copy and pasted all these options into ChatGPT and told it like break up these like communication style, context, clarification, handover and escalation, other guidance, and then ChatGPT created like this for me. But I first gave it like a detailed prompt with everything what I'm trying to achieve. So let's take a look of this. Communication style, use a confident, professional and friendly tone. Avoid cliches, hope this finds you well. Use short conversational sentences. So this is like communication style. Then context and clarification. Our goal is to help B2B SaaS and service companies book 
then my offer the AI agent should clarify if the lead wants more information ask if they open for a quick 20 minute call confirm if the lead is the right person and then an example here and then handle and escalation immediately notify the human team via slack or tag and stop auto replying if the lead asks and then some pain points and some stuff that we actually want to be notified so that the agent doesn't respond and then other guidance and information i think this one is uh, really big so definitely here we have the calendar link if reply replying to a question can you send me more info include the loom link and then here, never send follow-ups, emails if a meeting is already booked. So you need to manually like change booked, but theoretically it's connected with Calendly, so it should know it. Send up to seven concise follow-ups. So we do like seven follow-ups and you can get creative here, okay? And when you click continue, the other two ones are to connect your Slack. So like when you get a reply or something, you can see all of that in a Slack channel. So I would recommend that you create like a separate Slack channel and then collect, connect your Calendly. So if you're using Calendly, which in this case, it's a big benefit, you connect it and choose your calendar. So let's go back here and take a look like um, with this one. And you get some really nice here, like um, statistics, right? Month to date involvement rate like 81%. So this is basically like how much it, was it involved in all the conversation. Resolution rate like 74%. This is like even uh, without interfering with the human. Total replies 116. Human intervention needed 52. Time saved 4.4 hours. Average confidence score 89%. And then you have this like graph with replies and everything. And in here you have like this, um, you see request review, email send request review. And let's take a look at some of these. Let's say this one. So this one is like remove. And then I was playing to see like, just to answer to the, like unsubscribe me and stuff like that, which we usually do just to increase like the reply rates or something. But let's go back here. So this one is follow up. You see like email send or follow up. So it's really good at doing follow ups as well. So in here, let me just take a look. So this person said like, uh, okay, this platform is doing this and this. We seek distribution partners and then text for the detailed explanation, your folks, and then trying to book them in, just bumping this up. And these are all like sent by AI follow up. So three days later, two days later, and then this one was the same day and then three days later again okay this one was the same day because we did it manually just to see like how it will behave but usually then it's going with their flow so if you interfere you're gonna just like double up messages but it's doing pretty nice job like with uh, with the follow-ups and everything and you can actually track everything in here which is pretty neat so these like request review okay this one last please take me off your list and you can just click here and for each of these you're using credits so let's say for like let's go back for credit usage i think i should be okay this is the configuration so the configuration is like as i said like this everything is in here and this was just duplicated it's connected to slack and calendly so pretty straightforward you can definitely test it out but when it comes to the credits, let me just check here. Credit usage, okay. And here you can see like the usage, right? So it uses like credits each day, okay, 29. So I was first on the, on the lower plan, I think it's like 50 bucks or something. And I used all credits before ending with the month. So, I was sending like to 8K people, let's say, 9K people. So like 100, 150 replies. But um, I believe I was double charging because I had the human in the loop and the AI agent that's fully automated. So right now we just closed the human in the loop. So I'm gonna track it for the next month, definitely. I can uh, let you know in the comments. But uh, I think even with the like uh, 50 bucks per month with 1500 credits, you should be able like to easily handle like uh, 
10k 15k emails if you're sending but still it's worth like um, the other options would be you building out na10 workflows to handle all of, all of that i'm gonna be covering that in future videos as well but like even for clients or something if you're doing um, b2b lead generation i think this can be really nice to use you can calculate that into your expenses and that's actually what we're right now doing and uh, it's it makes your life a lot easier and it's a big added bonus for your clients and then here you can see like all this credit usage and uh, by theory it costs like uh, five coins or how do they call these credits to generate a reply even if it's send not send whatever and then uh, with like all the follow-ups and everything so if you have in one day let's say five follow-ups and like four positive replies that will be nine interactions nine generated replies that's like 45 credits right so we'll have we, we will have here that, uh, like 45 credits probably that's some that kind of scenario here 15 20 and then here we had 62 and stuff stuff like that okay so I hope this helps you. I really like it so far. I don't think I'm gonna turn it off. I'm just gonna be fine tuning it, testing it on different campaigns as well to see what can be better, especially on the side of these like uh, additional guidance and information, like to have better follow-ups, better, more creative waves, of actually how we do it uh, normally and maybe even testing these voices and stuff but yeah all in all I like it nicely done instantly and uh, looking forward to the new agents and everything so yeah if you like this check out my communities on school we have the free school community where you can join and get started going with free content and we have the accelerator with like step by steps how to set up cold emails how to get clients and actually we have a real nice guarantee where we promise one client your first or next high ticket client in 90 days or it's free so yeah thank you for watching and see you in the next video